guys hello here so today i'm going to be showing you guys how to use the lucas power steering stop leak so the issue with this car right here is that it leaks power steering on the bottom it's a slow leak but after a couple of months of staying here when i park it it has damaged the driveway which i would have to clean off so I'm gonna show you exactly the issue that I'm having. So as I pop open this hood, the power steering sits right here. And it's quite hot because I just started the car not too long ago. So this right here is the issue that I'm stuck with. It's losing power steering fluid. Right here is the power steering. I have to add power steering every week or so. So it doesn't run out. And that's where usually I keep it at. So this power steering isn't really working to stop the leak. So today we're going to be trying Lucas power steering. It's a different consistency right here as by checking the power steering consistency of the power steering is a lot more thicker so i think that prevents the power steering from leaking looks like it would stop it so i'll have to check and it is leaking from about right here it's a 40 year old car so probably something's clapped in the power steering system which is causing it to leak so first what we're going to do is we're going to siphon out the old power steering fluid. So now that I've got the power steering system open, I got the siphon pump running back to the old power steering fluid. And I'm going to be draining all this power steering fluid until it's empty. So you can see we, we got some left to make sure that the new Lucas oil is by itself and it's not mixed with any other power steering which could cause the effect not to work and it would be still leaking so i'm gonna siphon all this up and get back to it so now that i've got a lot of the fluid drained out right there i'm going to grab my lucas oil read your owner's manual on where you should put it sometimes if you overfill it too much it might start leaking again so I want to make sure I get it right, so I'm going to take a look at my owner's manual, and we'll see where we're supposed to go. So now that I've got it open, I'm going to start adding the power steering fluid. I'm going to do it kind of like this, slowly. Just make sure to get it around in order to stop all the leaking. This is a different consistency, I can tell, from the other fluid. <clears throat> And once I get it filled up, I'm going to get back to so it. So now that I've got it open, <clears throat> it's all filled up right now. I'm going to clean around it so it doesn't get on the belts. But that's pretty much where I would put it at. I'd have to wipe here too. I kind of spilled a little bit there. You know, it's <clears throat> you're going to make some mistakes if you haven't done this before. going to spill a little. I took off the cap because this was too slow. You know what I mean? I'm gonna close it and save this for later in case it does start leaking again. Racks and pinions, it's guaranteed to stop leaks or else I get my money back. So yeah, that's pretty much it on the power steering. And then I'm gonna give an update to see if it has leaked at all. So this is nighttime right now. This is about two weeks after I added the Lucas power steering. I've not yet touched it or opened it after cleaning the spill. So now we're gonna see the moment of truth. <clears throat> Let's see. We still have probably some old residue of oil. Maybe some new. Let's see if this actually worked. I've driven this about maybe about 30 miles so far. So yeah. It looks like it has leaked a little bit. 
tiny bit. It's probably the old power steering in the pump still leaking. So definitely it does sort of slow up down the leak. Probably for the most part won't really stop it. But it's definitely slowed down. I remember I had to fill it up a lot more often. Now it's a lot less. Does it cause a mess? It's about the same from before, so. I do recommend it for about 12 bucks. Definitely does beat paying the German maintenance of a couple hundred dollars just to fix the power steering. And pretty sure it's leaking from but right here, you see all this what it's getting on? Probably leaking from the pump itself. And not really the tube. So yeah, that's my install on the Lucas Power Steering. Do I recommend it? Yes. I mean, it won't fully stop the leak, but it's definitely a lot better than having to fill it up. And with about the same price as regular power steering, I would get it. Just make sure you're not overfilling it. And using it properly and thank you guys for watching i will continue this r107 series we'll probably be doing an oil change by myself a lot of maintenance on this bad boy right here it's definitely a learning project on some german maintenance but as it sits power steering is slightly leaking but better than before thank you guys for watching the video please like comment and subscribe and